The next concept I want to talk to you about is a pretty easy one, but it's important to understand as we go forward. And that is the concept that lenses are additive. Okay. So what I mean by that is if we have a plus three diopter lens and a plus two diopter lens, and we shine light through these two lenses to a point, they function the same way as a plus five diopter lens does. Okay. So a plus three diopter lens and a plus two diopter lens in a row is the same as a plus five. And likewise, a plus three diopter lens and a minus two diopter lens functions the same as a plus one diopter lens. Okay. The other thing is if we can add cylindrical lenses too. So if we have a plus three cylindrical lens and a minus two cylindrical lens, as long as the axes are lined up the same way, they're additive the same way. They are additive if the axes aren't lined up the same way, but just differently. Plus three minus two does not equal one. Then you'll get something different. Um, and you can have a spherical lens and a cylindrical lens. So if I had a spherical lens that was plus three, plus three, so that's plus three sphere, and I had a cylindrical lens that was plus two plano, so that would be plus two axis 180. You add these two together and they're additive. So what you end up with is along the top where you have like plus three and plus two, what's plus three plus two? Plus five. And along the side where you have plus three and plano, what's three plus zero? plus three. So this is what we're going to be doing in the next steps. And this is what we do during refraction. The concept is if we need a toric lens, if you needed to have a toric lens for everybody that walked in that, to your eye clinic, you'd need an infinite number of toric lenses to help everybody. Plus three, plus five, plus three, 25, plus five, plus three, plus four, 75, plus three. It's just a millions of them. But if you can build, if you can somehow use a, two different lenses to add up to one toric lens, now all of a sudden you just need a limited number of building blocks to build any type of toric lens. Like you can have a, the same million bricks, you can build hundreds of different types of buildings. And that's kind of what the concept is. But you have to understand this, this theory that lenses are additive. Okay. And understanding that will help you go on to the next step. And now we're ready to go on to the next step.